Why Mars? You might be asking, why not Jupiter or Saturn or even Venus? Well, let me tell you, Mars is the perfect target for humans to explore and maybe even live on. First off, it's close. Mars is just a few hundred million miles away from Earth. The outer planets are much farther away. It would take forever to get there. Second, Mars used to have water, rivers, lakes, maybe even oceans. Water means life, and it means humans could survive on Mars with the right tech. Those ocean-going probes have found all kinds of cool stuff. There are rocks and minerals that could help us make new tech. And we think there might be ice under the surface, too. Third, Mars has a day that's almost the same length as Earth's, just 24 hours and 39 minutes. That makes living there feel more natural. If the days were much longer or shorter, it would mess with our sleep and our bodies. So that's a big plus. Fourth, Mars has gravity. Not a lot, just about 38% of Earth's gravity. But it's enough to keep humans healthy. If we went to a planet with no gravity like in space, our bones and muscles would start to break down. We'd start to die. The other planets are way too extreme. Venus is a scorching hot hellscape. Jupiter is a gas giant. There's no solid ground. Mars is our best chance to survive, explore and expand human life beyond Earth. That's why the whole world's eyes, including yours truly, are on the red planet. Now, do you know what else is on Mars? A bunch of cool stuff. There's canyons and mountains and volcanoes. One of the volcanoes is taller than Mount Everest. There's also signs that there used to be lots of water and maybe life. We want to find out if there still is. We also want to find out if we can use the stuff on Mars to make life better for people on Earth. That's why we're sending robots to Mars. They'll search for water, signs of life, and cool rocks and soil. Maybe one day they'll even find a Martian fossil. With all these clues, we can learn more about the universe and our place in it. We can learn how planets form and what life is like beyond Earth. Who knows? Maybe one day you'll be the one exploring Mars.